We're back. It's Wednesday. I told you I'm gonna take you shopping. You had to sit through that crazy informational carnivore video. And I know it seems complicated and crazy and expensive, but it's not. It's simple, it's easy, it's effective. I'm gonna take you shopping right now. I'm gonna cook for you. So let's go. Oh, that's a lot of eggs. <laughs> that's it. That's it? That's it. That's enough food for the week. That was the easiest grocery shopping trip ever. I've ever seen. Like seven days. <laughs> I obviously have supplements and my protein shakes and my the beef jerky and stuff, which I'll show you, but that's it. That, that's enough food for a week. 97 bucks. Yeah, so 97 divided by seven, if we're gonna do some quick math, what is that, about 13, 14 bucks. 14 bucks a day, yeah. eating only meat, breakfast, lunch, and dinner. We're gonna go to the house and we're gonna cook. I'm gonna show you what I do. I really wanna show everybody what I do with that heavy cream. Somebody, oh, just the, what is that? Stole something. The, no, it's the lung color. It's the lung <laughs> color. Planet Fitness Planet is going fitness. off. You. You're out of here. Let's see the pedal. I hear you. I hear you. This is what I use as a snack. I'll link it in the video. Uh, it's 180 calories. There's zero carbohydrates, all protein. Herbs and spices. Uh, I use a tri-tip seasoning. Cinnamon, cumin, smoked paprika, ground ginger, Garlic powder, I'm almost out. Go to herbs without getting too fancy or parsley, oregano, tarragon. I, I love tarragon, some people hate it. Black pepper also. Curry powder is great, especially if you're using uh, gaming meats. I have this sofrito seasoning from Trader Joe's and uh, Himalayan salt. Uh, the last couple pieces, I, I use olive oil, Trader Joe's, simple stuff. I have my supplements, which I take daily. Minus my multivitamins, CalMag Zinc with vitamin D, I have a buffer vitamin C, and then an immunity boost, none. All right, and then the meat and the eggs. I get three pans going, so it's fast. A healthy sprinkle of olive oil, that's probably like a quarter cup. I cook all three at same time. I keep the heat on high. I'm gonna check it in about five minutes. Two tablespoons of butter. Simple salt, pepper. Scramble these bad boys, easy. And then you can just turn off the heat once it's that, and then just let it slow scramble the rest of the way, and you're done. I'm gonna check on the ground meat. Now we're getting some color. Three days. We're gonna split this into three. One pound of steak. I eat the fat. I don't know what other people do, but I eat the fat. Let's just... This you want super high heat and all the butter. Two tables. Go get that butter, it's sizzling. This is what you want before you put your steak on. The ground meat is done, so two tablespoons of butter. To finish it off. I use a measuring cup to split up uh, the meat. It's ready. Uh, whatever's left over, I just save it and I take it with me so I can use that as a snack. And you'll see there's gonna be a lot left over. So I just eat this throughout the next few days. You must hate this diet. <laughs> yeah, yeah, it's horrible. 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 <laughs> so here it's done and the calories will put right above it. So you know how many calories you're gonna spill through fat, all that. So I'm 
so excited to share this with you. This is my super hack for carnivore keto. It tastes like sugar from the heavens to me. We want to use about a cup. Uh, I like to eyeball it. So I take this handy dandy little mixer. There's a low speed. That's where we start. We have a semi creamy consistency. It's thick. It's a thick boy almost, but not a thick, thick boy. Cocoa Pebbles protein. We're gonna take a scoop, which is 25 grams of protein. Gently. It's so good. The longer you take and patience you have, the smoother it gets and the more like frosting it becomes. All right. So your dessert becomes a Cocoa Pebbles protein frosting that is keto friendly, it is carnivore friendly. Uh, maybe not perfect, but definitely friendly. It's absolutely delicious. I'm gonna have Devin try this. I'm really curious. Um, this is within his boundaries, so here. Okay, take here a little finger. Oh my God.